What's up Montreal? This is Sarai Gamliel with CUTV. Uh, we are at the Fringe Park and we're going to check out what's going on here. Uh, right now they are judging the macaroni salad. Let's check out what people think. How's the macaroni salad? Well, I guess my question is, what should I be looking for? Because of course it's delicious, it's salty and creamy, but are there any are there any special notes I should be looking for? Or? How does it taste? Mm. Very good. When I, Very... when I think of craft dinner, I think of kind of like late night drunk food. And um, the best part about that late night drunk food is that you kind of don't really need to chew it. <laughs> you know what I mean? So. Um, this is paying homage to a late night drunk craft dinner, but uh, it's providing real cheese and it's going another place that I didn't expect to go. It is what we like to call perhaps an oh oh oh. Il y a un concours de macaroni, est-ce que vous allez l'essayer? Oui, ben c'est ça, mon frère me dit de, de venir essayer le, le craft dinner l'après-midi, c'est pour ça que je suis ici, là, ouais. So, why are you guys here today? Uh, we are doing a French festival theatre show, and uh, we are interested in mac and cheese contest, because uh, I've never heard that in Japan. So, so you're from Japan? Yes, from yes. Tokyo. 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 Hey, comment? C'est doux un peu, manque de sel. <rire> Je vous à l'autre au pesto, hein. Est-ce que vous l'avez essayé? Oui, 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 mais pas de fois la soupe à la bière et au manche là. Mais euh, j'ai essayé plusieurs trucs, oui. OK, c'est quoi le préféré? Oh, bonne question. And what did you make for mac and cheese? Uh, our mac and cheese is my exploding mac and cheese. It's a curry taste, and we put many uh, a little bit Asian taste. Mm -hmm. so we're going to be selling this pot on eBay now because after winning this competition, it's going to be really something that's really desired by a lot of people. Wow! Well, yeah, and like traditionally, people are very. Um, Perceptive, so like next year, people who want to win the contest will probably want to use this pot. Yeah, because it's got magic in its bones now, guys. Now that look at that thing, that's, that's a like a work of art. That's, that's, a that's an antique already. Uh, do you want to show the pot to our cameraman? Well, see it there. Don't show him too much because yeah. like there's actually you see there's a little some, remnant there as well. Some of the secrets still in there. Did you want a marshmallow? Or? Uh, you know, I'll have I'll have one. Thank you. I love marshmallows. The judge really loved our mac and cheese. They said delicious. So, do you think you'll win? Uh, mm, hope so, <laughs> because uh, there are a lot of interesting and funny, delicious mac and cheese there. So we are so excited to see all the kinds. Um, I'm not sure what they said because it's, uh, it was in uh, it was in Arabic. But yeah. uh, well, I believe that they loved it. It's, I our first, they it's our first time being in France, so yeah. we're like, we don't really... So we don't have our atlas with us to translate the language, right? Right, yeah, uh, we don't really understand what's going on. So, you think it's positive, right? One judge did give me a high five. And high uh, five yeah. is one of your more positive shows of I think positivity. that's an international sign for you guys won the contest. Where are you guys from? Where? Uh, I'm not sure where Chugger was actually. I born. yeah, I, it's debatable. I was um, I was actually found. Yeah. Um, He's a found object. I was found. I was yeah. discovered under a, uh, a a footbridge by a guy named Christopher Columbus, who, right. who raised him. Right. That's right. That's yeah, right. Yeah. He's, he's a really good at finding things, Christopher Columbus. Yeah. Really good. Tell me what's in your macaroni salad, or what was in it? It's a slow cooked uh, macaroni soup. We're putting it out on the table so people can try it. Yeah, we're it's hoping people don't steal the idea, but we we wanted a it's simple. Oh well, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's basically. I would really like to see you try it. 
ingredients here are basically uh, marshmallows, beer, and craft dinner. And of course the cheese that you get. We want to keep it simple, like a lot of people are doing more gourmet or dishes than that, but we also feel like, you know, they're all kind of running out of time, right? And we didn't want to run out of time because we know how these sorts of things work. So we had an ample amount of time to slow cook our craft dinner for 16 minutes. And uh, so now this is what you have, right? Really nice. It's inspired by the actor Patrick Duffy, actually. That's where we got the idea. Because he used to do a lot of craft dinner making on uh, that TV show Dallas. And so that's sort of what inspired us to do this. Yeah, really nice. You want to try some? Uh, well, the marshmallows add this sweetness that comes out later. It's like... And then it happens after. Like, you don't notice it right away. Uh, you really gotta, like... It's really nice, guys. Really nice. Alors, le prix du public, il reçoit un magnifique certificat. Alors, ce prix, ils vont pouvoir l'encadrer sur leur mur au Japon, mesdames et messieurs. No, Japan, not Toronto. No, not this one. So, Osarasu, mesdames et messieurs, prix de présentation. This has been the macaroni salad competition. Hope you enjoyed yourself. My name is Saragam Liel, and I'll see you next time with What's Up Montreal. So, what city are you, like, you're visiting now, where do you usually We're live? Lethbridge. We're Lethbridge. Lethbridge we Alberta. lived in Windsor for a while. Uh, we lived in a That's place called really Deep Bear, Saskatchewan, for a while. Yeah, I still have a vacation home in Deep Bear, Saskatchewan. It's yeah. not really a home, it's more of a tent, Yeah. but it's a vacation tent. Exactly. He's really good at camping. Chugger's an expert at camping. A lot of people don't know that. So how do you guys like France? I'm in Nome, Alaska. How do we like France? Yeah. Really? What's I your mean, favorite part? The people are just, it's, for me, it's the French people, you know? They're yeah. really nice, really accepting. Uh, like, for I like example... The roads. I'm a really big fan of the roads here. Yeah. Because there's, like, they go in a lot of different directions, right? I'm used to roads that are sort of more one direction. These ones are going this way, that way. Some of them even curve. Yeah. Like, really, really, a lot, really a lot of them are well paved done. as well. A lot of them are That's paved right. here. That's right.